The reigning player of the year in the PBA is none other than E.J. Tackett. The guy who had the title three times before that, Jason Belmonte. They're in this Scorpion battle. So will there be an exchange of player of the year honors? This Scorpion championship will say a lot about that. I think if you look at it on paper, it is pretty close. You know, he's got a couple of stats above me, and I've got a couple of stats above him. So, I think if he wins this show, uh, and I don't win any of these other shows, it would certainly um, bring the race a little closer. That's for sure. with uh, Jason and I he's made three shows this week um, if I can get the win on this show it makes him have to win one of the other ones um, and, and that's what I believe so um, I'm gonna tr go out and do my best and um, hopefully I come out victorious <laughs> There is that incredible pin action he gets. Even a light hit can be dangerous. Well, we spoke to you about 30 minutes ago in the last match, in the last uh, Cheetah Championship, and you weren't feeling too well. How are you feeling now? I'm fine. Yeah, I mean, I'll, I'll do my best. I, I feel like I've got an okay reaction on the lane. Um, I'm going to hit my spot and close my eyes when I'm, I'm in the back there. Stop. Yeah, that one got away from him. It looked like it hooked early in this match already. Almost trip two. Big trouble now for Brandon Novak. There it is. He's in. Jason Belmonte will have a chance to add a 16th title. And it will be Tackett versus Belmo. What a finish. What a finish. Play of the year battle coming up. We always used to say you had to beware of that sick player. One, two, three, and that's Belmonte. And look at him right there. I mean, he's he doesn't have a whole lot left. Question for me and for everybody watching is does he have enough to get by EJ Tackett? I think EJ Tackett is locked and loaded. And as, as long as EJ can stay ahead of the transition, I think he's gonna give Belmonte all he wants. A boatload of rev rate. Belmont kicks aside the 10. There you go. Which is pretty darn good. Cup and uncup and unload it into the lane. Lather, rinse, repeat. Look out, oh yeah, that was trouble through the face there, and he leaves a makeable spare behind. Oh my! 7 10 simultaneous breakup. Right. Fell off a bit again through the face in a 4 9. Well, that couldn't have come at a worse time. There's your mark. Yes! There's your winner. DJ e. Tackett. Title number nine.
presentation of a check and trophy. We got our champion, E.J. Tackett. Here to present the check, we have Mr. Todd Elliott, VP Sells. Right here, buddy. And here to present the trophy, we have Mr. Dave Okay, careful. Oh, it's like in pieces. Gotcha. All right, so yeah, just make sure you take care of that. Yeah. <laughs> All right, you know, well, EJ, a very exciting tournament. Uh, what a great way to finish. A, a couple more heavyweights going at each other. But you ended up on top. And uh, on behalf of Pepsi, I'm proud to present you with this check for 29. Uh, congratulations. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Absolutely. Have a good day. Good performance. I appreciate it. Hi, EJ. I'm so proud of you. Great score of the tournament. Thank you. On behalf of the nation, here's your trophy. Congratulations. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, E.J. Tackett. Nice to see you again. That's right, good to see you too. <laughs> now, if you would please tell the fans what this means to you. We know it's number nine. It doesn't get old. It comes from against new every time. What does this win mean to you? Um, it means it just as much as the first win. You know, it's it's so hard to win out here and uh, pull against a great competitor like Jason Mamani. He obviously is one of the best in our game. To, to be able to hold him as many times as I have over for the past few years, and, um, I think I think our record is pretty even now. But uh, Jason, just in case you didn't hear that, our records are pretty even. I think. That's right. Um, <laughs> but it, it, it never gets easy. It never gets old. Um, it, it, it feels like it keeps getting harder and harder. You know, that first game, I uh, had to really dig deep. These guys are always big scores. Um, I got some fortunate breaks from uh, Brandon and, and Sean there. Now you and Bill are considered you know, the best in the game today, and there are a lot of young boys that aspire to be just as great as you. So if you could give us some advice, what would you tell them? Um, the, the best thing I ever tell uh, juniors or any amateur bowlers is spare shooting is, is so key um, in our game that when you get down to this level, if you miss a couple of spares in a block, it can cost you maybe a cut or a show. Um, and also, a, a physical tip I always give everybody is uh, use your legs. You have a lot of power. So ladies and gentlemen, once again, give it up for our champion, E. Jim Tackett. And if you'd like to have an autograph or take a picture, 